Hello my friends, what I'm doing here is uh, opening up a hive where a colony's been uh, robbed out by my other colonies. It's uh, mid-October, it's still warm enough that the bees are flying, but they're not bringing anything back. And uh, all the other colonies ganged up and robbed this out in uh, probably a day and a half before I put a robbing screen. Oh, there was a bees trapped up in here. So I got the robbing screen on too, too late. I just wanna see what's in here. Like I said, it's mid-October next week. Actually, in a few days, we'll have snow on the ground. So let's pull a few frames and see what kind of damage they did. There are bees in here. I really don't like breaking the bridge cone between the boxes this late in the season. Okay, so I hope I have this in frame. So here's some robbed out. Uh, this was a full frame of honey and stuff. Looks like, I don't know what that is. That looks uh, very strange. But yeah, they uh, make quite a mess of it. No weight to it at all. So, I don't know how well you see these frames. After all, all the wax cappings, everything's been. So what I'm going to do is look for bees, see if I can find brood, or the queen. There are bees in here. Basically all these frames are useless. Well, they're cleaning them up. Okay, there's resources on that one. Yeah. It might be too late for this colony. The other side, there's, there's a problem with it being robbed out. Again, this just took a day and a half. I noticed a lot of bees flying the first day, and then the second day, I noticed what they were doing. And I put a guard on the front. So there's brood that was just about to hatch. It's all been left unattended. It didn't hatch. I've got pollen. So they didn't rob the pollen out. I've not seen a cluster of bees in there. Bees decide to rob another hive or another colony's hive. It doesn't take long. They've taken all the honey. This would have been where the honey was, the tops. The bees put honey all around and then brood here with you know <clears throat> pollen and bee bread and such. And what the other bees have done is taken all the ay ay ay.
just nature though, it's the survival of the strongest, or fastest, smartest, whatever. This was the weakest colony, according to the other bees, obviously. These cap cells there, that's brood. They have little holes in them, which means they were starting to come out. There's no nurse bees anywhere to be seen. So, if there is a cluster of bees, if there's a queen still alive in here with bees. That's the question. Again, I got pollen, bee bread, not one bit of honey. When I was applying mite treatment, this frame had been uh, emptied. This is drone brood frame, the green frames, larger cells. Uh, it all hatched out and was back filled with honey. So I left it in there because I figured, you know, it's a good would be a good frame of honey. So all that honey's gone too. There are bees in here, but I don't think there's a colony in here anymore. And again, that would have been all honey. Bunch of dead bees on that side. Now just leave these frames out to hang. And the bees can clean them off if there's anything left. Oh, it's glued in there good. Gonna rip the frame apart. Okay, so that would have been just thick with honey, you know, like an inch out. It's all been shredded down. No honey left. Now we see if there's a colony in here. Get into the bottom brood box. Oh. That didn't sound good. Okay, not very good light. But I am not seeing anything. Let's see if you guys still see anything. Have the best light out here for me to see even the what the camera's picking up. Let's take one of these middle frames. to the queen or the bees. I don't know what happened to the colony that was in this. But they are gone, I think. Kind of good in a way. I don't know if you noticed, but this box has spacers. The nucleus I started this with had uh, really thick frames that wouldn't fit together nicely, and I decided to put in a box of spacers instead of. Wow, that's in there. I'm lifting up the whole box. But yeah, there's no bees in there. 
I mean, there's bees in there, but not the, not colony. There should be thousands, not a dozen or whatever. But yeah, these frames are light. There's the brood. No nurse bees. So yeah, the robbing didn't result in just the loss of honey, but the loss of the colony. They couldn't uh, defend the, the hive body and take care of the bees. They left me with some good resources. We'll have to scrape off all the brood or else it'll mold. Uh, yeah, it's sort of sad being down a colony and winter hasn't even started. Yeah, there's no weight to them at all. Pull all these frames out and show you the bottom of this box here. If I can get all these frames out. I can't see. Oh, a lot of propolis in here too. That frame has weight to it. Mm -hmm. Not honey though. Now bear with me a minute, I'll get you to the bottom of this box and you'll see it's full of all the wax that was stripped off. Oh, that's a nasty brood comb. Hey, bees love that, I bet. That was some dark comb. Thick, too. Yeah, I expected to find a colony in here. Not There's something on this frame. Yeah, it's all resources. Lots of pollen and bee bread, but no honey. And no bees, no colony of bees. see anything. All right, I'm not sure if that's in the camera or not. I got to the bottom of the... All it is is probably a good quarter of an inch deep. Thicker here, half an inch, probably there an inch of uh, all the wax cappings. Okay. There, was, there was enough honey in this colony uh, to last a winter and it was stripped out. That's everything that's left. So this is good. I packed up this wax. I can use this. Yeah. Let's look at uh, what happens when uh, you let the bees rob out a colony. 
completely destroyed. One of my colonies and I lost one of my queens. Which isn't the end of the world. It doesn't surprise me the other bees chose this colony. It wasn't the weakest colony as far as number of bees or how full the boxes or how heavy they were. But uh, they were a really poor honey producer um, <clears throat> compared to the one right beside it here. Uh, like five, six of my honey came from this hive and barely any came from this one. And they started out the same in the spring. So something was wrong with them, I guess. And now they're gone. So I'll leave the frames back here in the box. Next couple days, I'll let the bees rob them out. I'll remove the robbing screen. But yeah. So in less than what is that? Uh, cell cappings on the black background made it look like little, little worms or something. This is my eyes being paranoid for pests. All right, well, there you go. Not everything is uh, rainbows and sunshine in the bee yard. And when they're getting ready for winter, uh, the bees are merciless. I don't feed. Uh, I don't feed sugar. I put uh, frames of full frames of honey in all these highs uh, when I treated for mites a month ago. So, I mean. I could have done besides sugar feed but I'd rather lose one one of my uh, colonies than pollute all of my colonies because I do believe only feeding sugar in emergencies but I guess it would have been an emergency eh? I lost my hive you found this interesting or, or helpful at all or you know <laughs> if you feel sad for the bees don't all the other ones are fine it's nature but uh, yeah give me a thumbs up subscribe if you like always happy to make new friends here on the channel looking forward to get to know you have a great day wherever you are whenever you watch this peace <laughs>